Welcome back. We're going to see now how to work with images. So before we start, let's delete the code that we don't need. So starting from the beginning, we don't need any more uh, X position circle and Y position circle. Then event, we can delete the keyboard events just say pass for the moment we will change it later the same for the mouse pass it, it, it basically it is saying that when there is detection of this event it, it's just going to skip it and do nothing and so let the mouse position the circle And here we have our clean code. And I found this image on Wikipedia. Uh, these are two similar images uh, where there are some differences. Here you can see there is a branch. And here there is there are just clouds. Here there are some people and they are not here and there is this building here and here there isn't and probably something else uh, i haven't checked it properly yet but let's start using this image now so now we need to download the image in the same folder where we have our code and how can we see the folder so let's go here to PyCharm and then here is the folder spot differences here is the path but we can easily click with the right button of the mouse and show in Explorer and this is where we have our code and then let's click with the right of the bot the mouse save image and okay I already have set before the folder but you can just copy this folder and no okay the, the folder from show this one show an explorer you copy this one on the one that you want to save and and then after you can we can change the data because it is too long globe let's just call it globe globe pictures and let's save it let's go back to PyCharm and here we can see our picture now we need to load the, the image inside our game so let's add a new variable let's call it emg or whatever you want equals by game dot image dot load and then let's put here the name globe what, what, globe pictures dot jpg yeah exactly and this should be enough for the moment so let's just show it inside our screen so the code will be screen dot blit emg and then the position and we are we want it to start from the point zero of the screen so zero zero and let's run it here we see that we don't have the full picture because our window is it's not big enough to be able to have the entire picture inside we could do our transform and scale our picture or in this case it's better that we change the size of our window to fit the picture so 
let's first see check the dimension of the picture let's select like properties details and so dimension it's 1200 pixel of width and 450 of height so let's do the same for the window it will be 100 and 450 and let's run it and here so now we have the entire image loaded inside our window what now now we can get some let's first to de detect all the position uh, regarding the differences so let's first check this one the branch so I will first draw a rectangle by game dot draw dot rect um, on screen now I'm going to make it black position let's say 350 0 300 and 250 and we have to remember to draw it after the image otherwise the image will cover our rectangle no we were close but not and let's add the width so we will have a re an empty rectangle so let's try 250 and no even 200 and the height 170 okay we're getting closer 170 here 250 okay we just got good start here we can do with a little bit less so maybe instead of 250 it can be like 190 and the height for sure it's much smaller and let's see 60 ah okay really close a little bit higher and wider and 200 okay we got the first one the branch uh, maybe just a little bit shorter 70 and so we're going to do the same for all the differences because our game will be that if you have the, the user that plays it have some let's say one minute and he has to find the difference so when he clicks here we need to know that here there is some difference so now we're going to define all this rectangle where there are the differences and so here we have the first one and then by game dot draw dot rect screen like let's check the second one ah. the second one can be something Okay, let's say that I will first find 
the differences then I will update the video without losing any time with this code right now so here I'm back again and I added ju just added these two lines of code uh, regarding the other two differences we had this one before the branch and now we have this building and these people so you can just copy them first one is pygame.draw.rect is uh, the branch this one the second one pygame.draw.rect Rect screen black 0 171 20 30 and 3 this is the width of the rectangle and this is 0 on the X so I'm referring to the the people on the left and this one is the building the really small building far away by game dot draw dot rect screen black 138 125 16 26 and 3 and this is all for this video and see you in the next video.